Hey, assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh to all the Muslim brothers and sisters worldwide. Because of lack of knowledge, we experience doubts in our heart. Our present state and pitiful situation has caused our enemies to conquer, disgrace and humiliate us. If we paid attention to the rectification of the heart, then the Ummah would be rectified through it. When the heart is ill, it becomes inclined towards things like smoking, music and women. On the Day of Judgment, a person will be held accountable according to his intention. So it's important that we do good deeds to please Allah Ta'ala alone. The Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, Allah Ta'ala does not look at your appearances, but what Allah Ta'ala looks at is your heart and your actions. Allah Ta'ala says in the Holy Quran, Woe to those with hard hearts who have turned away from the remembrance of Allah Ta'ala. One of the best ways we can strengthen as an Ummah is by studying the correct Aqeedah. Umar Ashqar has an excellent series on Aqeedah. Inshallah ta'ala, I will put the link below this video inshallah. and I strongly advise my brothers and sisters to read his books. You know, the shaitan, he said, he will lead all of mankind astray except a few. And one of the ways he does this is by diverting people away from the remembrance of Allah ta'ala. So it's important that we don't let him do this. We should keep remembering Allah ta'ala on a daily basis. You can even just listen to Quran but focus on the remembrance of Allah Ta'ala because this is a major cure and a major protection from harm an excellent way to remember Allah Ta'ala is by saying after each prayer after each salah subhanallah 33 times alhamdulillah 33 times and Allahu Akbar 33 times and then say one time la ilaha illallah wahdahu la sharika la if you can't do that, then just say SubhanAllah 33 times, Alhamdulillah 33 times, and Allahu Akbar 33 times. You know, people complain to the scholars about their Imam being low and about them being you know, in bad situations. But what, what they don't realize is most of the problems can be cured by praying five times a day. If you don't pray five times a day, and you're experiencing problems, it's most, it's most likely because you don't pray five times a day. So inshallah ta'ala, by praying five times a day, inshallah ta'ala, a lot of your problems will disappear. You know, the Zionists are preparing for the Dajjal. You know, you see these uh, rappers and celebrities doing the one-eye symbol. So it's manifest. Their preparation is manifest. So what we need to do, inshallah ta'ala, is become strong in Iman, because if the Dajjal, if the Dajjal appears, and our Iman is weak, it's very likely that he will dominate us. So it's important that we have a, have a routine where we remember Allah Ta'ala on a daily basis. And it's important that we keep praying five times a day, recite Surah Kaf on a Friday, and inshallah Ta'ala, stay strong in the deen. When the first major sign appears, the rest will follow swiftly. So it's important that we prepare for the Akhirah, and don't let the dunya consume us. For the youth, I would recommend keeping off social media because it is a tremendous fitna. The reason I am on social media right now is because I'm doing the dawah. But for years, I avoided it because it's got so much fitna, so much evil, and it distracts one from the remembrance of Allah Ta'ala. So initially, you know, unless you're doing dawah, I would recommend keeping, keeping off social media. One of the reasons why we are being humiliated as an Ummah is because we have divided into sects. This is a problem. So it's important that we follow the correct sect. And inshallah ta'ala I will post a link in the description below with a book that explains the, the saved sect. It's important that you learn this because there's a lot of deviant groups out there who 
are upon innovation. As you know, our brothers and sisters in Palestine are going through a tough time at the moment. So inshallah ta'ala, leave a positive dua in the comment section below this video. Inshallah ta'ala, the shuhada are in Jannah al firdaus flying around inshallah ta'ala. If World War Three breaks out, we need to be prepared. So it's important that we follow the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and we focus on the akhirah and don't get too caught up in the dunya. If the Muslim Ummah as a whole focused on the remembrance of Allah Ta'ala, praying five times a day, fasting in Ramadan, giving the zakah, if all the Muslims in the world did this, we would be victorious. And the, the disbelievers and the oppressors and the enemies wouldn't stand, to, wouldn't stand a chance against us. The issue is, the problem is, most people don't focus on the remembrance of Allah Ta'ala. And a lot of people don't pray five times a day. And a lot of people don't fast in Ramadan. So this is the issue, without a shadow of a doubt. If everybody had the correct aqidah, and if everybody prayed five times a day, fasted in Ramadan and gave the zakah, of that we would be victorious. And we wouldn't be, be, we wouldn't be humiliated like the way we are being. I hope this video is beneficial, inshallah ta'ala. Please share it around, subscribe to my channel, leave a comment, making dua for the brothers and sisters in Palestine. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.